Hi and welcome to today's video in the Study NFA's Daily Vid series. Today's video is for those of you who want to do your bachelor's from the USA with the biggest scholarships possible. In this video, we'll be sharing the complete information on full ride scholarships. Full ride scholarships are scholarships whereby you do not need to pay any tuition and any living expenses. We will also tell you how to get full tuition scholarships, whereby you pay for your living expenses, but you do not need to pay any tuition fees. These scholarships are highly competitive and awarding merit-based full ride or full tuition scholarships to international students is a complex process that involves a careful evaluation of various factors. Colleges and universities aim to attract the brightest and most promising students from around the world. And these scholarships serve as a tool to achieve that goal. So, what will you learn from today's video? The first part of this video will be about the criteria you need to fulfill to qualify for these scholarships. Then, we will discuss the process and timeline for these scholarships. Finally, we will share a list of colleges and universities in the United States that provide these scholarships. So now, let's talk about the criteria you have to satisfy to get a full ride scholarship or a full tuition scholarship. First, there is academic excellence. A really great grade 12 score and an exceptionally high SAT or ACT score are essential prerequisites for international students seeking full ride or full tuition scholarships at colleges and universities in the United States. Your GPA is your grade 12 score translated onto the American GPA scale of 0 to 4.0. The SATs or the ACT are standardized tests that you can take in most countries in the world. These academic achievements demonstrate a student's commitment to academic excellence and their ability to thrive in a rigorous higher education environment. Together, these metrics serve as a strong indicator of a student's academic merit, making them highly competitive candidates for scholarships that recognize and reward exceptional academic achievement. Next, universities will also look at the academic background of a student while assessing his or her application for full ride and full tuition scholarships. Universities offering full ride scholarships and full tuition waivers to international students prioritize evaluating the strength of the high school curriculum, the rigor of the coursework, and class or board rank due to several important reasons. Firstly, assessing the strength of the high school curriculum provides insights into the student's commitment to academic excellence. Universities look for challenging courses such as honors, advanced placement or international baccalaureate programs as they demonstrate a willingness to tackle demanding coursework Students from the leading higher secondary boards will find it easier to demonstrate the fact that they have undergone a rigorous curriculum after grade 10. Secondly, the rigor of coursework showcases a student's ability to thrive in academically challenging environments. It indicates whether the applicant has pursued advanced or specialized subject which is a strong indicator of their readiness for college level studies. Lastly, your class or board rank helps universities compare an applicant's academic performance to their peers, offering context to their achievements. Students who rank high in their class or board exams demonstrate exceptional academic competitiveness, making them attractive candidates for scholarships. The college essay, a personal statement, holds immense importance in the pursuit of securing a full ride or a full tuition scholarship for incoming freshmen in the United States. 
While academic achievements and standardized test scores provide a quantitative measure of a student's capabilities, the essay offers a qualitative measure that allows applicants to showcase their unique qualities, experiences, and aspirations. The college essay provides a platform for students to distinguish themselves from their peers. It's an opportunity to narrate personal stories, articulate goals, and demonstrate a deep commitment to their chosen field of study. Scholarship committees are often flooded with applicants who have impressive academic records, making the essay a critical tool for standing out. Additionally, a well-crafted essay can reveal a student's character, resilience and values, helping scholarship committees assess whether the applicant aligns with the institution's mission and values. It provides insights into a student's potential contributions to the university community, both academically and through extracurricular involvement. Furthermore, the essay allows applicants to convey their passion, their creativity and unique perspective, which can be compelling factors in scholarship decisions. It humanizes the application and helps committee members connect on a personal level with the applicant. In conclusion, the college essay or personal statement serves as a powerful means for students to present themselves holistically beyond their academic achievements and make a compelling case for why they deserve a full ride or full tuition scholarship. It's an opportunity to leave a lasting impression and demonstrate the qualities and potential that institutions seek in their scholarship recipients. Recommendations from teachers and counselors hold immense importance in the pursuit of full ride or full tuition scholarships for incoming first year bachelor students in the USA. These letters provide valuable insights into an applicant's character, academic abilities, and potential for success offering a perspective beyond what can be gained from transcripts and test scores. Teacher and counselor recommendations serve as a credible endorsement of an applicant's qualifications. They can vouch for the student's academic prowess, work ethic and dedication to their studies. Moreover, these recommendations can shed light on an applicant's personal qualities, leadership skills and contributions to the school community. Scholarship committees are often looking for students who not only excel academically, but also demonstrate a commitment to making a positive impact on their surroundings. In terms of how these letters should be worded, they should be genuine and specific. Teachers and counselors should provide concrete examples of the student's achievements and character traits. The letters should highlight the applicant's strengths and unique qualities that make them a standout candidate. Avoiding generic or cliched language is essential, as committee members appreciate authenticity and detailed accounts of the student's abilities and potential. In the competitive landscape of securing full right or full tuition scholarships for international freshmen in the USA, Attributes such as student leadership, community participation, exceptional achievements, research and entrepreneurship experience, as well as awards and honors on your profile are very important. Demonstrating leadership skills showcases an applicant's ability to influence and lead others. Universities are keen on students who can take initiative, organize events, and inspire their peers. Leadership experiences in clubs, organizations, or student government demonstrate a commitment to making a positive impact on campus. Active involvement in community service or volunteering activities demonstrates a student's commitment to social responsibility and a desire to give back. 
scholarship committees, value applicants who have made meaningful contributions beyond their academic pursuits. Exceptional achievements, whether in academics, sports, the arts or other areas, set applicants apart. These accomplishments indicate a level of dedication, talent and perseverance that aligns with the Institute's pursuit of excellence. In an era that values innovation and problem-solving experience, research experience and entrepreneurial initiatives are highly regarded. These experiences highlight a student's intellectual curiosity, creativity and potential to contribute to advancements in the field of studies. Awards and honours, whether on a local, national or international level, provide external validation of a student's talents and capabilities. Scholarship committees often see these accolades as a testament to an applicant's exceptional abilities and contributions. Alignment with institutional values plays a pivotal role in the process of obtaining full-ride or full-tuition scholarships for international freshmen in the United States. Universities and colleges are not merely looking for academically outstanding students. They are also seeking individuals who resonate with their core values and mission. Firstly, demonstrating alignment with institutional values illustrates a genuine interest in becoming an integral part of the university community. Scholarship committees appreciate applicants who have taken the time to understand the ethos, goals and culture of the institution. It signals that the student is not merely seeking financial support, but is genuinely committed to contributing to the institution's academic and social family. Moreover, alignment with institutional values can also help scholarship recipients thrive academically and personally. When students' beliefs and principles align with those of their universities, they are more likely to engage in meaningful ways both inside and outside the classroom. This engagement often leads to a richer and more fulfilling educational experience. Furthermore, institutions offering scholarships often aim to cultivate a diverse and inclusive community that reflects their values. Demonstrating alignment with these values can enhance an applicant's appeal especially if their background or experience contribute to the university's diversity goals. Now, let's summarize the prerequisites for getting a full-ride scholarship and a full-tuition scholarship. You need to demonstrate academic excellence through your GPA and SAT or ACT scores. Your academic background should also demonstrate that you can handle the rigors of coursework at an American university. Your personal statement or college essay is a window into your character that is immensely important. Recommendations from your teachers attest to your academic mettle and provide insights into your work ethic. Finally, if you can demonstrate alignment with institutional values, it shows that you have been able to thrive in the student community at a particular university. Next, let's talk about the whole process of applying for a full-ride scholarship or a full-tuition scholarship in the United States. Before you understand the process, it is very important to understand the concepts of early decision and early action. Most international students choose the regular decision option when applying to an American university. But if you are meritorious, early decision and early action are great options to get in with a scholarship. Early decision and early action are admissions options that you should choose if you're interested in the biggest scholarship. Early decision or ED is an option in the admissions process for both domestic and international first-year students applying to colleges and universities in the USA.
It is a mechanism that allows applicants to submit their applications early, typically by late October or early November, depending on the institution for a specific round of admissions, usually the fall term of the following academic year. So, if you have completed your 12th grade in your home country, let's say in April or May, you can apply for early decision in October or November and start your studies in the university in August or September of the next year. The defining feature of early decision is that it is binding. When an international student applies under the early decision plan and is admitted, they are required to enroll at that institution and withdraw all other college applications. It's a commitment to attend that specific school if admitted. The application deadline for early decision is typically in late October or early November. If you want to start your classes in August or September of the following year. However, it's important to note that deadlines can vary by institution. So it's crucial for applicants to check the specific deadlines for each school that they're interested in. Applying through early decision can potentially increase your chances of receiving a big scholarship or any form of financial aid. This is because colleges and universities want to attract the most meritorious students through early decision and give the biggest scholarships through this admission option. Early Action or EA is an admissions option in the United States that allows both domestic and international freshmen to apply to colleges and universities earlier than the regular application deadline. Here are the key details about Early Action. Early Action is a non-binding early application option. This means that if international applicants can choose Early Action and are admitted, they are not obligated to enroll and can still consider other offers of admission. Generally speaking, the early action application deadline is around November, a little later than the early decision deadline. However, this can vary by institution. It's important to check the specific deadline for each school you're interested in because they might have different dates. Early action offers several advantages. It allows applicants to receive admission decisions earlier than the regular decision pool, typically by December or January. This early notification can relieve some of the stress associated with the college application process and provide more time for planning. Early action applications also give you a better chance of getting a scholarship than regular decisions. Now, let's talk about the process and timeline for obtaining these scholarships. The process and timeline we will talk about is most relevant to students who are doing the 12th grade now and will give the board exams in early 2024. If you're studying in the 12th grade now, the two most important things you should do is to start working on your profile and work really hard on your study. Working on your profile means that you should try to add student leadership experience and community participation and leadership to your profile. At the same time, try to get involved in interesting and valuable projects, competition and events. It is also a good idea to cultivate great relationships with your teachers because these teachers are the ones who will be writing your recommendation letters. While in grade 12, you can also start preparing for your SATs or your ACT. However, remember that your grade 12 studies should be your first priority. So I recommend that you spend no more than four or five hours per week on the SATs or the ACT. At the same time, you can also research universities in the USA that provide these big scholarships. You should be looking for universities whose values align with your own. Later in this video, 
we'll be sharing a list comprising dozens of universities that offer full ride and full tuition scholarships to meritorious international students. Now, let's talk about the process after your 12th grade finals. By the first quarter of the year, most students will have finished with their board exams. Once you have given your 12th grade final exams, you can start the most important part of the process. The next step is to ramp up your preparation for the SAT or the ACT. At the same time that you are preparing for your SAT or ACT, you should do more research on colleges and universities that offer scholarships and choose your final list for early action or the university you will apply to in early decision. While doing all this, also start working on your SOP. By August or September, you should appear for the SAT or the ACT or both and hopefully obtain a great score. A score of 1400 on the SATs or 30 on the ACT will make you eligible for many colleges and universities that offer full ride and full tuition waivers. By the end of September, you should also get the rest of the application like your CV, your SOP, teacher recommendations, co-curricular and extracurricular certificates and financial documents ready. Apply before the deadline. Remember, October and November are the months with the deadlines for early decision and early application. By January or February, you will hear back from the colleges and universities you've applied to. Your offer will state what your scholarship is. If you have applied to several universities through a non-binding early action application, you have to choose which university or college you want to attend and accept the offer. Once you have accepted your offer, it's time to start preparing for the visa application. You should apply for a visa well before the semester start date. Typically, you should apply for the visa between March and May before the semester starts in August or September. You are allowed to travel to the USA a month before your classes are scheduled to start. Your classes should start in late August or early September. So, that was the process from start to finish. Remember, it's a long process that lasts more than a year, but the rewards are greater than the time or effort you invest in the process. Now, let's talk about which colleges and universities you can apply to through early decision and early action for full ride and full tuition scholarship. First, let's discuss no tuition promise institutions. A no tuition promise or tuition free promise typically refers to a commitment made by colleges and universities or educational institutions to cover the full cost of tuition for ineligible students. Several colleges and universities in the USA extend their no tuition promise to international students, exemplifying their commitment to accessible higher education. These institutions, often publicly funded, provide tuition fee education to eligible international students, making education more affordable and inclusive. By welcoming international students under the no tuition promise, these schools not only promote diversity, but also offer an opportunity for students from around the world to access quality education in the United States, contributing to global learning environments and fostering cultural exchanges. More importantly, there are dozens of universities in the US that provide full ride scholarships and full tuition scholarships to international students. For the full list of no tuition promised universities and universities that provide full rides and full tuition scholarships, click on the link in the description. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more videos like this. We hope this video has been able to give students who want to study their bachelors in the US and their parents 
a better idea of how to get the biggest and best scholarships for your bachelor's study in the USA. To know more or to actually start the process, connect with Study Unifees for your plans to get a scholarship in the US for your bachelor's study. To connect with us, just log on to studyunifees.io. Till then, all the very best for your future plans.